Hey, uh, guys, uh, I forgot to inform you in the last video. Um, so whatever we created using CloudFormation stack, how can you delete it? So just go to the CloudFormation here, click on stacks. Uh, if you hit on CloudFormation, you will get this. If you get this window on the left, you have there is a burger symbol, hamburger symbol here on the left side. Click on it and then click on stacks. So when you hit on this, you'll get this. So you just hit on this and then click on delete. Okay, when you hit on delete, so it might give you like delete and failed. So what uh, we have to see what exactly it's causing the problem. So right now delete in progress. Wow, so it's wonderful. Now it is deleted. So I forgot to add this uh, thing in my last video. So I'm sorry for that. Okay, so you can delete the stack like this. So when you delete the stack like this, what happens is whatever you have created, say for example that Elon Musk which I've created if you hit on IAM um, if you go to users I don't have that Elon Musk okay now if you go for S3 here so all those um, um, uh, you know the buckets which I created that was also not there okay it's something on cats and dogs or something and uh, also if you want to see the policies let's see whether the policy is there or not the custom policy which we created that should not be there as well okay So this is a policy which I had created, you know, two videos back, but uh, the other policies, it's not there. Okay. So only for customer management, there is only one which I had created to read. I mean, uh, that this is not a part of cloud formation stack. Okay. So that is the beauty of it. So if you create it, it will be created every, all the resources in cloud formation. And if you want to delete it, you just you know delete the stack you don't need to go individually and delete each and every resources okay thanks guys